Welcome back everyone. You probably know by now that a new COVID-19 stimulus package was passed by Congress, signed into law by President Trump back in December. What you probably don't know is that legislation also included the most sweeping changes to health care since the Affordable Care Act. So how will those changes impact you? Well, Ed Herman is with the law firm Brown and Crouppen. He's been looking into this for us, Ed. Uh, you know, we've heard a lot in recent years. We've seen numerous headlines about surprise medical bills. That's been a new yes. big gripe for a lot of people, rightfully so. And so this legislation tries to help with that. How so? Well, I mean, just so people understand what surprise billing is, this is a situation where typically it happens when you have an emergency type of situation. So they're giving you a bunch of treatment before they've had a chance to even check your insurance. Then all of a sudden they check your insurance and it turns out that a bunch of the stuff that you had done to you was done with an out of network provider. And all of a sudden out of nowhere, you who thought you had good insurance with just a reasonable copay or deductible finds out, oh my God, you know, while I was, you know, after that accident or, or after my heart attack, I racked up this, these tremendous bills that are not covered by my insurance. They're out of network. Those are surprise bills. And, and what this new law attempts to do is it creates a situation where if a situation like that comes up, it basically almost forces the healthcare provider who is going to charge the exorbitant bill to basically get their money from your insurance company. And your insurance company can really only hold you to your copay or your deductible. Mm -hmm. So what it does is it, it sort of forces the out of network providers into an in network situation. Now they, they will do sort of the, um, they're going to have to work out the contractual discounts between your insurer and the provider but it shouldn't affect you as the consumer. So this is really good news for consumers, uh, especially people that have health insurance and they know that if they're in network, they're in good shape. And if they're out of network, they're in lousy shape. This should fix that. And hopefully, I say hopefully because they're trying to address it, but I don't know exactly how they will. They're trying to clear up this idea of, of being more transparent with pricing. A lot of people go into a facility and they say, I have no idea how much this is right. going to cost me until I get the bill. They do make a, a, a kind of a swing at that as well. They do. And it, 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 that's a difficult topic because you would think to yourself, well, a procedure should cost what it costs. But it's not like that. If you're paying cash and don't have insurance, the MRI might be $1,500, but with Blue Chorus Blue Shield, it may be that the hospital is willing to take $600 right. from Blue Cross Blue Shield, but that's a contracted discount for Blue Cross Blue Shield because they know they're going to get a lot of patients who have Blue Cross Blue Shield. Mm -hmm. So Blue Cross Blue Shield will use their negotiation strategy to command a better price from the hospital, whereas you know, the hospital doesn't have to offer the better price right. to just anybody. So that's why it's so difficult for them to simply have a, a price list that says this is what all of our services cost. But of course, you could understand the temptation to say, let's just just tell us what this stuff costs. You know, <laughs> don't tell me there's one price for me yeah. without insurance, but a different price for somebody else. Yeah, it, it, it should cost what it costs. So I don't know that this will actually solve that, but yeah, they're, they're taking a stab at it. They're trying. Well, we'll find out in 2022. That's when it's scheduled to go into effect. Ed, thank you very much. Sure, absolutely. If you'd like to get in touch with Brown and Crouppen, you can call them anytime. It's 314-ALL-TWOS or check out their website, getbc.com. And while you're online, you have got to check out getbctv.com for tons of funny, entertaining, informative videos from Ed and the rest of the gang at Brown and Crouppen.